Good morning, everyone. My name is Lauren, and I am a first year graduate student here at BU Wheelock. And today I'm very excited because I get to take you guys along for a day in my life as I take over the BU Wheelock Instagram. So just a little bit about me before we get started. Oh, those are my Santa decorations <laughs> for Christmas. Um, like I said, I'm a first year grad student. I am in the counseling master's program with a concentration in child and adolescent mental health. And I am also a graduate assistant at the graduate admissions office here at Wheelock. Um, so today, I don't have any classes today, but I'm going to be going to work. I'm going to be running some errands. I'm going to be working on some projects for school. Um, so throughout the day, if you guys have any questions, just let me know. And yeah, we'll go ahead and <laughs> get the day started. Hey everyone, so I'm at work now and I kind of want just to come on here and explain a little bit of what I do in the admissions office. Um, so I'm a graduate assistant, um, so that basically means that I am here part-time basis and my role in the admissions office is to kind of help um, with a lot of administrative stuff. So I check in applications, I check the email, I answer the phones, um, I also run tours and other virtual and in-person events for students to connect with us and just, you know, promote the college. And also while I was here, I wanted to highlight two important dates coming up. The first is tomorrow, December 1st. That is our doctoral deadline and our spring priority deadline. And the other date is December 15th, which is the final deadline for spring. So I've been checking in a lot of applications today, seeing everyone get in their stuff on time, which is great. Um, and yeah, so I'm gonna put a link down here to the admissions website so you can uh, check out all of our programs and all of our deadlines and all of our application requirements and just let me know if you have any questions. Thank you guys for sending in some of your admissions questions. Um, I'm gonna take some time to answer them now with the help of my boss, Gabe. Hi guys, my name is Gabriel Redondo. I'm a graduate admissions coordinator here at BU Wheelock. Um, typically for applications, you will hear a decision around six to eight weeks following our recommended deadline. However, during the holiday seasons, um, such as Christmas or Thanksgiving, sometimes uh, that time frame may vary and be a little bit longer. So yes, if you are missing any materials in your application, you will be reached out via email with the email that is connected to your application. Um, and if you have any questions about any materials that you're missing, you can always email us at wegrad at bu.edu. It got cold, it got rainy, and it got windy, and a massive bag of groceries to unpack. But I am in for the night, I want to get started on some homework, and also answer any of your questions that you guys might have. So if you have any questions, uh, let me know, and I'll start responding to them as I get started on my work and unfortunately unpacking my groceries. So that is an excellent question, and a very valid question, and may or may not be from my mother. <laughs> so I actually have a little poll. So I, since I just went grocery shopping, I was thinking of making a soup with this miso ginger broth from Trader Joe's and adding like some frozen vegetables in it, making kind of like a stew, or being a little less, not lazy, but yeah, maybe a little bit more lazy. <laughs> and heating up some of these chicken and chili tamales. So tamales or vegetable soup. Let me know. Um, so this question is in regards to housing. Um, so housing, um, there are two options for graduate students. There's on-campus graduate housing, which I'm in, and then there's off-campus housing, which is just finding an apartment in Boston. Um, I'm gonna link the um, BU graduate housing website down below. Uh, they're not affiliated with Willock, so I don't really have that much information in terms of um, how it works, but with my experience, I applied um, right around April, I think, and I got in, I got a unit, which was really nice. Um, I think it all just depends on uh, what your priorities are in terms of housing, like your budget, the location. Um, my apartment is really close to campus, which is very nice. Um, it has all the utilities included, which is great too. Um, but it's definitely more of like an individual, uh, I would say, preference. Uh, but nonetheless, I'll link it down below and you guys can check it out. All right, so how did I decide on my program? Um, I majored in psychology in undergrad. 
um, and I loved it. It's something that I'm really passionate about, um, but I knew I didn't want to go into research, at least not right now, uh, to get my PhD. So I knew that if I got my master's, I could start practicing right away, or at least after I get my license. Um, and I really enjoy the fact that BU has the specific child and adolescent concentration because that's a population that I have experience with and that's a population I want to end up working with. Um, so yeah, I think the, having the option to have that concentration um, and also just access to the resources that BU and Boston in general has in terms of, you know, healthcare systems and in, uh, opportunities for internships and potential employment as well, uh, those were some really big factors that drew me to BU. Alright, I think this is probably going to be my final question of the night um, and a great one to end on. I think my favorite thing about my program is the people. Uh, that's including the professors um, and the peers that I have. Um, the group, my cohort right now, they are just so incredibly intelligent and kind and there's a real like support network that I felt that we built up even in like the three months we've been here. Um, they push me to do better every single day and I look forward to going to all my classes, even the ones I have at 8 a.m. and the ones I have at 6.30 p.m. because of my peers and my professors are so incredibly nice and intelligent and they really care about what they're teaching to us and they want us to succeed. So yeah, I think it all just comes down to the people and it's just, you know, yeah, they make it what it is and it's an incredible place to be. Thank you guys so much for following along and date my life. I'm really glad I was able to kind of give a grad student perspective on this. Um, if you guys have any additional questions related to admissions or anything like that, I'm going to link um, the email and the phone number down below. And also, if you guys just want to talk about maybe my personal experience at we will a little bit more or the counseling program uh, specifically, my Instagram is going to be right up here. And you guys can follow me and you can chat. And yeah, if you guys have any other questions, please feel free to reach out and to contact me. Other than that, have a great night.